Question number 35. A solutions architect is developing software on AWS that requires access to multiple AWS services, including an Amazon EC2 instance. This is a security sensitive application and AWS credentials such as access key ID and secret access key need to be protected and cannot be exposed anywhere in the system. What security measures would satisfy these requirements? Option A. Store the AWS access key ID secret access key combination in software comments. Option B. Assign an IAM user to the Amazon EC2 instance. Option C. Assign an IAM role to the Amazon EC2 instance. Option D. Enable multi-factor authentication for the AWS root account. Correct answer is Option C. Assign an IAM role to the Amazon EC2 instance. Question number 36. An AWS workload in a VPC is running a legacy database on an Amazon EC2 instance. Data is stored on a 200 GB Amazon EBS GP2 volume. At peak load times, logs show excessive wait time. What solution should be implemented to improve database performance using persistent storage? Option A. Migrate the data on the Amazon EBS volume to an SSD backed volume. Option B. Change the EC2 instance type to one with EC2 instance stored volumes. Option C. Migrate the data on the EBS volume to provision, provisioned IOPS SSD IO1. Option D. Change the EC2 instance type to one with burstable performance. Correct answer is. Option C. Migrate the data on the EBS volume to provisioned IOPS SSD IO1. Question number 37. A company's website receives 50,000 requests each second and the company wants to use multiple applications to analyze the navigate patterns of the users on their website so that the experience can be personalized. What can a solution architect use to collect page clicks for the website and process them sequentially for each user? Option A. Amazon Kinesis Stream Option B. Amazon SQS Standard Q Option C. Amazon SQS FIFOQ Option D. AWS CloudTail Trail Correct answer is Option A. Amazon Kinesis Stream Question number 38. A company wants to migrate a highly transactional database to AWS. Requirements state that the database has more than 6 TB of data and will grow exponentially. Which solution should a solution architect recommend? Option A. Amazon Aurora. Option B. Amazon Redshift. Option C. Amazon DynamoDB. Option D. Amazon RDS MySQL. Correct answer is option A, Amazon Aurora. Question number 39. A company hosts a two-tier application that consists of a publicly accessible web server that communicates with a private database. Only HTTPS port 443 traffic to the web server must be allowed from the internet. Which of the following options will achieve these requirements? Choose any two. Option A. Security group rule that allows inbound internet traffic for port 443. Option B. Security group rule that denies all inbound internet traffic except port 443. Option C. Network ACL rule that allows port 443 inbound and all ports outbound for internet traffic. Option D. Security group rule that allows internet traffic for port 443 in both inbound and outbound. Option E. Network ACL rule that allows port 443 for both inbound and outbound for all internet traffic. Correct answer is option A and option E and these are security group rule that allows inbound internet traffic for port 443 and network ACL rule that allows port 443 for both inbound and outbound for all internet traffic. Question number 40. A solutions architect is designing an Amazon VPC. Applications in the VPC must have private connectivity to Amazon DynamoDB in the same AWS region. 
the design should route dynamo dv traffic through option a vpc peering connection option b nat gateway option c vpc endpoint option d aws direct connect correct answer is option c vpc endpoint